Hello viewers, welcome back. Welcome to the new viewers. Okay, this is going to probably be a couple of videos because it got really intense as I was doing my research to get ready for this reading. Um, Laura Carlson asked me to read on Brad Parscale, um, and I hope I'm pronouncing his name correctly. Brad Parscale was hired by Kushner um, to be Trump's digital campaign manager and also the liaison liaison to the RNC during the campaign. Um, so he was paid $94 million uh, by Trump's campaign to be the digital campaign manager. Um, he worked for a company called Giles Parscale, or formed with uh, his partner, Giles, uh, which was later bought out by Cloud Commerce. Cloud Car Commerce, when you know, it, it all just keeps like building and building. Cloud Commerce got in trouble for financial fraud. Um, so the parent company now to Giles Parscale. So fraud people, fraud people, fraud people on top of fraud people. It's crazy. Um, Brad Parscale is who hired Cambridge Analytica. Cambridge Analytica, that little company that was formed by Steve Bannon and Robert Mercer, uh, that was involved in over 200 elections worldwide. They were involved in uh, Brexit, uh, you know, leave the e leave EU campaign, all that. There's more on that. I mean, it just opened up this whole can of worms of other people I want to read on. So we'll get into Cambridge Al Analytica shortly, but this guy. This guy, Brad Parscale, well, I'll stop there with the notes. He was hired by Kushner. Uh, he hired Cambridge Analytica. He probably has links also with WikiLeaks, uh, although that looks like it's much more Cambridge Analytica, in my opinion. Brad Parscale, Trump's campaign manager, and he is his campaign manager also for 2020. Um, you know, if Trump makes it to there, I don't think he will. So, Brad Parscale, how much work did you do with Russia? Is Mueller on you? Are you in some of those Michael Cohen files? Are you in some of those Manafort files? scale. Well, he had a plan. He had a plan he charged forward with. Hear that or that's Mueller charging forward with an investigation. of communication and swift action <clears throat> I would say there's a lot of emails and communication that Brad Parscale is privy to and listed in um, and that Mueller is on it um, in the foundation the messenger You know, using Facebook, using Twitter, using, uh, what is that other one, Alphabet something. Um, he was the messenger for all the propaganda as well as for Trump's platform. Here in the past, here's Trump. Um, and he charged forward with his messages recklessly. That's what I'm feeling. Um, he's also... Here in the near future, got the spy card. Um, trying to hang on to what he's got. Looks like a connection to Rebecca Mercer. I feel her energy on this card. You know, this this card uh, also for me can represent Nancy Pelosi, but I'm feeling Rebecca Mercer all over that. 
uh, and strength. Here's Muller, strength of uh, the connections. Ooh, Brad Parscale, are you going to jail? Looks like you've got a big loss. You planted all these seeds. You got involved in all this business and got all this money and you're having a loss and Muller's investigating you and it looks like you might be going to jail. Hmm. Might be in jail instead of running the digital campaign for Trump in 2020. Okay, that's going to be a short one. I'm going to do a separate one on Cambridge Analytica because there's just all kinds of notes I've got on different people I want to look at. So um, that's that's Mr. Parscale. I don't think we'll be seeing much of him in the future. <laughs> if you like the video, click the like button. Subscribe to see future videos. Um, Laura, thank you for that recommendation to look at him. Uh, oh my gosh, it just opened up a can of worms of other people I want to look at. Um, yeah, he's, he's not going to be around much longer, I don't think. Thanks for watching. Bye.